Right. Um, so I went to a gifting suite that um, CLDPR was having. They, the beautiful girls there invited me and it opened up my New York Fashion Week. It was the very first thing that I did. And I got to just explore all of their amazing brands and see all that they were doing. And it was an incredible experience. Um, they had some pretty amazing brands. So let's dig right on in. Um, you're going to see a lot of different things. All right. Um... Okay, so this bag is from McDougal. You know, anybody who knows me knows that I love a bag, especially a black bag. Um, in fact, let me show you my wall. That was my black handbag collection. And some people may say I'm a little obsessed because that was just my black handbags. And um, I love black because you can't go wrong with black. And once you go black, you never go back. But at the end of the day, this is just going to be another uh, addition to my collection. Um, all of McDougal's bags are 100% leather. They're beautifully made. And I haven't seen this bag since I picked it out of their entire collection. I don't have any bags like it. One that would have studs everywhere. Um, this is a very specific kind of bag. It's a bag that you can't wear everywhere. Um, but it's a bag that I do think I will choose to wear. Boohoo was there and um, they gifted me these really amazing forest green uh, leather pants, vegan leather that is. And I love that they're flared at the bottom. So these are going to get a lot of wear out of me um, for this season and into winter. Um, as you can see, they have the Boohoo label, and I am already obsessed with them. I just love them. And these are also vegan leather, but they have a little bit of the patchwork and cargo detailing on the leg. So you get to see a lot of the pocket detail as well. And as you can see, they are giving you a little bit of that brown detailing. And if you've been keeping up with fashion, then you know that brown is major this season. So keep your eye on brown because if you're brown, honey, stick around. All right. Okay. So this was what the flyer looked like for the events the brands that were present for the event. I hope I'm holding it up correctly. Right, let's see what else we have. This is dynamic resurfacing pads, facial pads. And I just love a good facial pad, so I'm definitely going to hold on to this. This is um, anti-wrinkle day cream, broad spectrum SPF 30 sunscreen. Um, and I love a good sunscreen. So um, sometimes we do have to be careful because sunscreen on black people can give us a gray casting. I don't know how this is going to be. But because this has such a high SPF, I am definitely going to try it. So, super duper happy 
that this was included and this is what it looks like. So, but now what is this? Is this weed? Oh, this must be a lip. Me and my boot and my boot coop rocking. All up in my coop and my uh, uh, rocking. Ladies, if you know y'all me, so you don't hang just me and my boot and my boot coop rocking. So you don't hang just bind up in your girl. All right, y'all, hold on. All right. This is a program from a fashion show that I couldn't, I hated. So I'm not even going to blast them. Because they was nice, but the fashions was a mess. <sighs> them fashions was awful. Them fashions looked like what that lady was wearing when they took that body out of the casket in Tyler Perry's movie. And he called all of y'all highbrow Negroes because y'all said y'all didn't like that movie. And he told Kiki Palmer that y'all was highbrow Negro. I know y'all remember. Rotten Tomatoes gave it a 0, 0.0. Oh, okay. Okay, wait. All right. So, y'all, I forgot. There is something else from the CLDPR. The CLDPR. The CLDPR gifting suite. This is Windsor. Now, y'all know I style. Y'all know I style. Y'all know I style. So, I did pick up some dresses to put some clients in. Windsor PR was giving away dresses. So, listen, I was like, now, y'all know I don't wear dresses, obviously. But, look, I done got some sample size dresses to put my clients in. These is cute. Like, because I'm getting ready to style this one girl who is um, doing Broadway. She's, like, a key choreographer for this Broadway show that's getting ready to premiere. So, I was like, oh, okay, this is perfect. Even though I... I'm pretty sure uh, for the premiere, I'm going to put her in another designer. But it's always good to show your clients um, like options because they always want to feel when they come in for the fitting that you got a rack full of clothes, child. So I just want to show her a rack. I rack. I rack. Not Afghanistan. I rack. So here go one thing. And it got this long little sash. A sash. For the cash, she says. So that's one. And then here go this other thing. What is this? Is this a dress? What was that? Oh. Here go this dress. This is cute, y'all. This is cute for her. This could be cute. Like a little knock around. Like this is cute. You could fight in this. You could fight in this. Like you could fight in it. And then. Cause, like you could definitely fight in it. I don't like people like don't try to play me out. Don't try to play me out. Don't try to play. You can't play with my yo yo. Don't try to play me out. Don't try to play me out. Eh, eh, eh. My name is yo yo. I'm not a ho ho. All right, y'all. So wait. This is cute. This is cute. It's a little gown. It's a little gown. Now see, y'all can rock this. Cause I remember back when I was doing. This is cute, y'all. I remember back when I was doing the Golden Globes and stuff. This is cute. Listen, I remember, I remember when, I remember, I remember when I lost my mind. Look, y'all, this is cute. This is cute, y'all. A little black dress. Everybody who know me know when I do my clients, I love to put a girl in a black dress. Oh, I forgot I got this. Uh-uh, I forgot. Y'all, this is, look, it's a jumpsuit. It's a jumpsuit. You could jump somebody in this. You could jump somebody in it. Don't. Don't. Kick down the door, wave it. Silly of me. Devoted so much time. True, thankful for you. I nearly lost my mind. One more thing from the CLDPR. So, there was a lady at the 
uh, gifting suite who I connected with. Honey, she was as white as mayonnaise. And y'all know. Y'all know. So, but her name was Jenny Lauren Jewelry. Her work was incredible. And I was so grateful for it. Get into it. Isn't it lovely? It's just beautiful. All right, child, let's move on, honey. Because we're almost done. We're in the final stretch. All right, y'all. Y'all know this name. A couple of days before New York Fashion Week, I got an email from Alexander Wang's team. And guess what they sent? Yes, y'all. Now, I own two Alexander Wang bags. This is my third. This is their latest, one of their latest installments, reiterations of his famous handbag. Just check out the detail. The pebbled leather is just an it. It just smells so well done. Like Alexander Wang is a master of fashion. And he just like, oh my God. So I went to his, I went to, and, and this bag is just flawless. Like look at it. The carrying is just amazing. The belt buckle detailing here. Y'all know where this is going on the black wall. Oh, my hands, child. Bag number two. Shout outs to my sis, um, Shantae. Y'all know her as Short and Sweet. Um, please check out her TikTok, Short and Sweet. Um, and on uh, Instagram, she's Coach Tay, T A Y B X, because she's from the Bronx. Um, I can't do the sign because I'm not from the Bronx. Uh, and I don't want to get popped. And then I have to pop somebody else. But um, Shantae gives some of the best content in New York. Uh, she's just extremely gifted. And the reason why I bring her up is because that was my road dog uh, the day I did uh, Alexander Wang. And that same day, I did Tommy Hilfiger. So I had to bring my sis down something from uh, Alexander Wang. Because he was giving away free clothes. Um, literally, everybody who went to the Alexander Wang event got free clothes. He was literally giving away Alexander Wang denim and sweats. So let's get into it. <laughs> I can't even believe this. So, my Alexander Wang hanger, never getting rid of that. Um, these are my Alexander Wang jeans, literally Alexander Wang, New York, and like, get into it. I will lose weight to wear fashion. Now see, all of this, oh, you gotta lose weight to be healthy. Come on, James. You got to lose weight to be healthy. I don't have to do anything but stay black and die. I want y'all to know that. But I will lose weight to fit into these clothes. So this is not going to fit me. So this I might get rid of no time soon. Like it will not fit me anytime soon. Them jeans, I can make work. These, This is a size small white. Alexander Wang sweatshirt. Now, I might give this to Shantae, actually. Because um, she might be able to fit this. Shantae, if you're watching, I might give you this. I might give you this, Shantae! Um, this is a white sweatshirt from Alexander Wang. Yeah, I might give this to her. Um, but it comes with these white sweatpants. Now, the sweatpants I could fit. Oh, these I could fit. Huh. 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 
These I could fit. So I'm like, stop it. Don't, you don't even, like, don't play with me. And then, Tommy Hilfiger was giving away these salted popcorns. <laughs> Did y'all catch me on CBS News, y'all? Y'all know they showed me on CBS News. I was sitting behind Damson Idris at um Tommy Hilfiger. Did y'all see me on CBS News? Y'all know I was on CBS News. Did y'all see me on CBS News? I was on CBS News. Now y'all know what? This popcorn look a little stale to me. Um, shout outs to Pepsi Cola. Uh, shout outs to Rihanna and Fenty for sponsoring the psych now I'm playing. Alright, y'all. Thank you.